And it was the face of Apollo Creed that changed my life. The face of Apollo Creed. It was like just by that motherfucker getting up, not winning, just by him getting the fuck up. Apollo Creed was, he was, he was champ. He's the best. Rocky had taken his soul, had literally taken his soul. His, his head goes down. He looks at him like, Who, what the fuck are you? I want it to be that, not Rocky. I want to be the guy that people looked at. I don't care if you like me or didn't like, I don't, I don't care. But said, this motherfucker is going to keep coming after whatever the fuck is in front of him. I wanted that. I wanted that. I wanted that worse than anything in the world. So that is, I kept picturing me falling down and getting up. And every motherfucker that called me nigger, I was dumb. Even myself, even myself. I wanted to feel something besides defeat. I wanted to just go to distance. And that going to distance pushed me to a point of where now I go way past the distance. So you go the first day, you, you run a quarter mile, and then you walk back home, and right. you're, you're, you're upset. How, right. do you, how do you move forward? So basically what I did was I came home, and I, <laughs> I had a talking milkshake. <laughs> I sat down, and I gave up. I said, this ain't gonna fucking happen, man. I could lose 106 pounds and I can't even go a quarter of a fucking mile. I started being able to take negative shit and be happy. And this whole, I say what if a lot, it sounds corny and it sounds weak, but it's true. One of the recruiters said, there's not many black Navy SEALs. Matter of fact, I was